क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर कैन यू ड्रॉ अ ट्राइंगल विच हैज ए एग्जैक्टली वन लाइन ऑफ सिमेट्री बी एग्जैक्टली टू लाइन ऑफ सिमेट्री सी एग्जैक्टली थ्री लाइन ऑफ सिमेट्री एंड डी नो लाइन ऑफ सिमेट्री स्केच अ रफ फिगर इन ईच केस सो स्टूडेंट्स वेर वी आर हैविंग लाइन ऑफ सिमेट्रीज देर वी हैव टू स्केच अ रफ फिगर एंड स्टूडेंट्स वी नो देर आर थ्री टाइप्स ऑफ ट्राइंगल स्केलिंग ट्राइंगल एसोसिलस ट्राइंगल एंड इक्विलेटरल ट्राइंगल वॉट इज फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन गिवन एक्जैक्टली वन लाइन ऑफ सिमेट्री सोल्यूशन यस वी कैन ड्रॉ एन आइसोसिलस ट्राइंगल विच हैज ओनली वन लाइन ऑफ सिमेट्री वाई बिकॉज आइसोसिलस ट्राइंगल हैविंग ओनली टू साइड इक्वल सो लेट इज ड्रॉ दिस फिगर स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज द इमेज ऑफ आइसोसिलस ट्राइंगल विथ वन लाइन ऑफ सिमेट्री नाउ लेट इज सी वेदर दिस इज सिमेट्री और नॉट विथ मीर सो स्टूडेंट्स Here, students, here we can observe from the mirror that it is the one line of symmetry triangle. Number B, exactly two lines of symmetry. Students, is it possible or not possible? No, because there is no such triangle which has exactly two lines of symmetry. So, solution. No, we cannot draw a triangle which has two lines of symmetry. Question number C. Exactly three lines of symmetry. Now, students, can we draw a triangle with three lines of symmetry? Yes. Which type of that triangle? It's a equilateral triangle. Hence, solution. Yes, we can draw an equilateral triangle which has three lines of symmetry. Why equilateral triangle? Because it has all three sides equal. Now, let us draw this figure. So students, this is question number C image with three lines of symmetry. One, two, and three. This is equilateral triangle because all three sides are equal in equilateral triangle. Question number D. No lines of symmetry. No lines of symmetry. Can we draw the triangle with no lines of symmetry? Yes. Which type of that triangle? Scaling triangle. So answer is yes. We can draw a scaling triangle which has no line of symmetry. Why scaling triangle? Because scaling triangles having all different sides. So let us draw figure of scaling triangle. So students, this is a students this is a figure of scaling triangle with no line of symmetry students students in this figure we cannot draw any line of symmetry if we keep here line of symmetry then figure is not equally divided if we keep vertical line of symmetry then also figure is not equally divided hence there is no line of symmetry and this is which type of triangle scaling triangle Question number five. On a squared paper, sketch the following: A. A triangle with a horizontal line of symmetry but no vertical line of symmetry. B. A quadrilateral with both horizontal and vertical lines of symmetry. C. A quadrilateral with horizontal line of symmetry but no vertical line of symmetry. And D. A hexagon with exactly two lines of symmetry. E. A hexagon with six lines of symmetry. So students, let us draw this figure. So students, let us see the figure with lines of symmetry. So students, this is the triangle figure. So here you can see this is which line of symmetry? Horizontal line of symmetry that we have to draw. So here it is asked in the question draw a triangle with the horizontal line of symmetry but we don't have to draw vertical line of symmetry now let us see with the mirror whether the figure is is symmetry or not students here you can see that the figure is equally divided students here you can see that figure is equally divided with horizontal line of symmetry Number B 
In question number B, it is asked a quadrilateral with both horizontal and vertical line of symmetry. So, students, this is the quadrilateral that is drawn. This is horizontal line of symmetry and this is vertical line of symmetry. Now, students, let us see with the mirror whether the lines of symmetry are proper or not. Here students you can see that the image is equally divided into two parts when horizontal line of symmetry is there. Now let us see for vertical line of symmetry. Here students you can see. Here students you can see that the figure is equally divided into two parts with vertical line of symmetry also. Question number C. In question number C it is asked a quadrilateral with horizontal line of symmetry but no vertical line of symmetry. So this is the image drawn. Now we have to see horizontal line of symmetry only. Vertical line of symmetry is not there. That is asked in the question. You can see that image is equally divided into two parts. But students if you can see with the vertical line of symmetry image is not divided hence. Here, only horizontal line of symmetries is drawn. Question number D. A hexagon with exactly two line of symmetry. Hexagon means how many sides? Six sides. So, one, two, three, four, five and six sides. With two lines of symmetry. So, this is horizontal line of symmetry. This is vertical line of symmetry. Hexagon is drawn. We can see with the mirror that the figure is divided into two equal parts with horizontal line of symmetry. Here figure is divided into two equal parts with vertical line of symmetry. Question number E. A hexagon with six lines of symmetry. Now here students you can see this is the six sides of the hexagon. Here we have to draw hexagon with six lines of symmetry because this is a regular hexagon having all six sides equal. So this is horizontal line of symmetry, then vertical line of symmetry, then we have drawn diagonally line of symmetry. Here this is also diagonal line of symmetry. This is diagonal line of symmetry and this is also diagonal line of symmetry. So students here there are six lines of symmetry in this hexagon. Question number six. Trace each figure and draw the lines of symmetry if any. So here different figures are given. We have to trace and we have to draw the lines of symmetry if it is there. So students in this question number A we can draw one line of symmetry. So it is known as which figure? Isosceles triangle. A. The given figure is an isosceles triangle. Hence there will be one line of symmetry. C. Figure B. So this is figure B. In figure B also one vertical line of symmetry is drawn. We can draw and one horizontal line of symmetry we can draw. So we will write hence the given figure has two lines of symmetry. Now figure C. In figure C first we can draw vertical line of symmetry. Then horizontal line of symmetry. Then students we can draw diagonally. Hence, we can draw diagonally also in figure C. So, we can write the given figure has four lines of symmetry. In figure D, we can draw horizontal line of symmetry as well as vertical line of symmetry. So, this is horizontal line of symmetry. This is vertical line of symmetry. Hence, it has two lines of symmetry. 
So the given figure is an octagonal which has two lines of symmetry. It is octagonal because it has eight sides. Now let us see figure E. In figure E, we can draw horizontal line of symmetry. So let us write answer of this figure. The given figure has only one line of symmetry. There was only one horizontal line of symmetry. Now, this is a star shape. Now, figure F. So, in figure F, we can draw vertical line of symmetry. Then, horizontal line of symmetry. Then, we can draw diagonally both sides. So, how many lines of symmetries are there? Four. Hence, we can try to answer that the given figure has four lines of symmetry. Question number seven. Consider the letters of English alphabets A to Z. List among them the letters have. Now, first question is vertical line of symmetry. Like A is having vertical line of symmetry, same way we have to write we have to write alphabets that is having vertical line of symmetry. A, at, I, M, O, T, U, V, W, X and Y. So these are alphabets that is having vertical line of symmetry. Horizontal lines of symmetry. Like B having horizontal line of symmetry, same way we have to write alphabets that is having horizontal line of symmetry. B, C, D, E, H, I, K, O, X. So these are alphabets having horizontal line of symmetry. Now students in number C it is asked that no lines of symmetry like Q. Q doesn't have any line of symmetry. Same way we have to write alphabets that having no lines of symmetry. F, G, J, L, N, P, Q, R, S, Z. So these are the alphabets that have no line of symmetry.